hello is how to port forward updated one because the other one sucks so anyways if you're an orb user go orb login.com if you're an orb if you're a non orb user don't worry just don't worry this is an extra step so go advanced advanced and router and go ap mode and apply what this will do is directly connect it to your modem instead of as a own router which is this page so if you want to go back to router mode remember go or orbilogin.com advanced advanced and router and router mode apply and then what it will do is restart uh, your router and then it will restart your IP config also because it's directly connected to the modem so after everything's done open your command prompt if you don't know how to do that open your what I do is search bar CMD type in IP config then you'll see here uh, your default gateway you can copy it or just type it in your browser and this is the classic for the page I'm pretty sure they're both admin and by the way your password for your orb it if you don't know what your password here just restart it there's like a pin in the back of your router if you don't know your orb so back here go forward rules and then port mapping in the last video i said dmz but please do not do that or delete it actually it's it's very not it's not secure i'm sorry so go application and remember click new application then dns but for some reason other people uh fix their issue with going http but just so you know the mapping name is anything for your internal host you can go for your ipv4 address which mine is here uh, i can copy it i can Control c or you can use your device name if you have too many here and you don't know which one it is go back to your command prompt type in host name you will see your device name for your protocol tcp slash udp and please i swear it is 25565 people will complain to me and then for some reason they change their uh port then they'll complain to me but it's always 25565 as long as you didn't change anything you don't need to put anything external just click apply that should be it so if you want to check run your server first it's loading i guess you can search for a port checker remember 25565 or whatever you changed it to if I click check, it's open now. If I close the server, it's closed. Now, okay, this is the troubleshooting. For some, as I said earlier, for some reason, even though it's supposed to be the same, a lot of people had, had it working when they put HTTP. Oops, why is this reset? I'll hit cancel. Anyways, so for the internal host, a lot of I, some people have a different IPv4 address than their device name. I recommend to use their device name first. But for I know a lot, some people will work uh, uh, will be working on their IPv4 address for some reason. If it still doesn't work, I guess what you can do is right click your wi-fi thing or ethernet open it network and internet network sharing click your urdu properties ipv4 use the following ipv4 so this is your your ip address uh 
I recommend to use whatever they have provided just to be s I recommend I just recommend and yeah you just copy it from your IP, IP config for your preferred DNS server just put in your default gateway click ok click yes now if for some reason your internet is gone click at the ipv4 address and aut obtain automatically and this delete uh, automatically again if for some reason you lose internet okay and then whatever you use on you set up there put it here the internal host then apply it should be work if it still doesn't work i'm pretty sure it's your firewall we can first check it here if you search for allow on app then click change settings you can just find java what i do is left click something and then just press j click j then i'm it to j make sure it is both private and public for everything even java w especially okay mine is both checked if it still doesn't work you might have to follow this tutorial i i, I i'm not i'm not sure which one i'm i think it's this one yeah just follow follow this if it still doesn't work then that's all i can give, tell you like if you're or i guess uh if you're using another router it will show you a static ip then use that static ip for the internal host that is all goodbye if you have problems uh tell me in the comments I i'll uh i'll i'll attempt to fix it but no pro no 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 promises also uh comment down if it works please uh it'll, it'll be nice to know that it, it works and this is your last resort go dmz this is, please this is not secure this is not secure guys click new check dmz you type in your ipv4 or whatever and you select whatever here if this works this means uh it uridu is really blocking your port on 25565 for some reason so that that's your clue that's all i can say it's just a clue there and then okay that is all again please like or just comment i, d I don't care about likes comment down if it works comment down if it doesn't work